everybody, along with Ray Ferraro down at ice level. My name is James Sabalski. Just moments away from puck drop, we'll send it down to ringside. Ray Ferraro between the pipes could be a critical area tonight, Razor. You've got to get into the other goalie's face. Both teams have talked about it. You've got to get in for second shot. Really, it comes down to will. How can you force the other team's goalie? Opening face-off is set to go. Referee Shil Levesque is ready to drop the puck. The Greyhounds take possession here on the opening draw, and we are underway. Sault Ste. Marie's got the puck against the boards. Let's it go! And too much traffic in front blocks that one. The Huskies move the puck in the defensive zone. Along the half wall with the puck. Ruin Noranda's got it along the wall. Hammers him in the open ice. The Greyhounds have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Here they come on the attack. Roberts will play it to the corner. A chance right in front. Stopped by the goaltender. the draw here in the defensive zone into the offensive zone looking to make something happen along the boards right in front with the shot and that sails high oh you got to get it on target he rifles it trying to be too perfect with possession along the wall let's it go he scores a quick goal here has the whole crowd buzzing they are tell the players are excited here with the early goal you can expect the coaches to be telling them to keep pushing the pace on the road team stick side's always a good place to shoot if the goalie's not down in the butterfly to smother that off it's going to beat the goalie because he doesn't have much to stop it with Sault Ste. Marie's on the board here and they've got the home crowd right into it early aggressively out of the gate they didn't give the opponent any time to get settled at all I love their start Puck is dropped and play resumes. Takes the feed. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. And he gets the puck right back. Blocked in traffic. Gets the puck back onto a stick. Into the corner. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. Stopped by the goaltender. More than half the period has gone by. Hope you're enjoying this one. We got a 1-0 game to this point. The frozen biscuits dropped, and we are back underway here. Through center along the wing. Sends a pass over. And that goes off a player in front. From the left side, he moves it up ahead. Here's a chance. Robert scoops up that pass. He's dangerous in this zone. He's already got the go-ahead marker. Shot! That's his second! Their line has played really well, James. I like the way they've moved the puck, and finally they're rewarded again. He's got them both. Ah, uh, the old standby, low stick. The goalie beaten clean here. He can't catch it. The Greyhounds have given themselves a two-goal lead here with two-thirds of this opening period played through. That's a nice cushion for them. You want to start well, they get one, that's great, but they tack on a second, and now they can feel pretty good about this 20 minutes they've played. And makes the save. Icing is called, stopping the play dead. Center's jammed up, and the winger grabs the puck. Moves it to Roberts. 
And just a total sprint down the ice and icing his wave on. That looked pretty cool to watch. Both guys full out to get to the puck. The Huskies look to start the transition game. From the right side and up the middle. Here's a shot, and he makes the save. Takes the pass from his goaltender. Carries it in. They've got numbers. Moves it around along the half wall. Heads deep inside the offensive zone. Let's one go. Oh, it comes up with nothing on the play. Oh, man, he's frustrated with himself. He's got to get that on the net. Here's a short pass to Roberts. Oh, I like this, James. They've really cycled the puck well on this shift. Now they can hold it, and you put the pressure on the defenders. Eventually, they pull you down, or you get a great chance. From behind his own net. The first period is all said and done with as the horn sounds. It's 2-0 after the opening frame. Pretty good start for one side, not so much for the other. And we are just moments away from the start of period number two. Well, after an intriguing opening period, here we go. It's period number two. Puck is dropped, and we are underway. Well, this one underway. Ray, give us an update on what your assessment is to this point. The Greyhounds will tell you they want to be a puck possession team. Well, they had it most of that first period, and as a result, they lead by two. Quick feed to Roberts. Roberts frightens the other team as soon as he collects the puck here. He's got two. He's looking for a hat trick. Moves the puck. Stopped by the blocker. Into the corner now. Puts it on net, and that goes absolute sideways. I'm not really sure what happens here. He totally miscues this shot. Roberts slides the puck along the line. Handles the puck. He scores while it rains and pours. Man, they are just coming out in buckets right now as they get three straight. Really a dominating performance. And play resumes as the puck is dropped. And that's taken by the defense. Takes it across the blue line. Moves the puck along the half wall. And that's broken up. They've got the defense outnumbered. He's got a step, and he comes up with it. Feeds it down low. From the slot, beats the goalie, but can't beat the post. And he misses. Isn't that just a confidence thing? Confidence are trying to be too perfect. Get it on the net. That's the number one goal. Deflected away. Sault Ste. Marie's got control of it now from their own end. Mackey's got it against the boards. Slides the puck over. Comes up with the stop. Scores! James, they might as well put both goalies in the other net there. That's four in a row for them. The Greyhounds have put on an impressive offensive display, but equally, their defensive performance, too. They look like they're from a different league. They've dominated this game through most of the first two periods. Sault Ste. Marie's got a hold of it along the wall. With the stop. That's in a dangerous spot. He makes a good save here. On the attack along the boards. Centering pass. Let's it go. And that's a paddling from the goaltender. Carries the puck up through center. Great defensive play to come up with the puck. Sault Ste. Marie's had excellent foot and stick positioning tonight. Their bodies are in the right place, their sticks are in the right place, and they intercept another pass. Takes the feed from the goaltender, and that's broken up with a stick in front. Gets it out of his own end. Ruin Noranda's looking to break out of their own end. Carries it across the line. Wrist one in front. There's the whistle as things will slow down here for a moment. Always a good play if you're not sure what's going on. Freeze the puck.
they start winning the draw here inside the offensive zone. The Greyhounds fail to capitalize on the man advantage. Both sides back to even strength. Here's a shot, and that'll make the highlight reels with that close stop. Marlowe's got the puck along the wing. Less than a minute to go here in the second. And that one stopped. Dead center, excellent save. Over the line they come. Here they are on the attack. Along the half wall with the puck. From the slot, wrist shot, huge stick save by the goaltender. Aggressive stop out on top of the crease to make the save on a dangerous chance. Comes up with the stop. With hot food and ice cold beverages. Welcome back, everyone. Both teams lined up at center ice, and we are ready to get this third period underway. Barring extra time, the final frame of this one. Hicks, what are your thoughts on the game to this point? Sault Ste. Marie's got a lead in this game, which is probably a last shot win sort of thing. Man, it's been out of control for two periods. I love it. Sault Ste. Marie's turned good defense into good offense as they lead it early in this third period. The Greyhounds have it from their own end. Brings the puck into the offensive end now. Here's a shot. Scores! Oh, that was a beauty! Sault Ste. Marie's all aware there's no mercy rule in hockey they continue to apply the pressure no they're laying a beating on these guys now it may be time to lay back just a bit sends the pass over gets the puck over to roberts takes the pass here's an odd man rush huge steal in his own end now he takes it over the line sends it over and that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. Gets in front of it. The Greyhounds gain possession along the wall. Sends it quickly to Roberts. Looking to make something happen along the boards. With some moment. He scores! There's the hat trick, and here come the hats. Man, it is loud in here. The guys jumped up on the bench as soon as that third goal went into the net. Well, the only way he's stopping this one is if it hits him. As soon as the shooter went to shoot it, the goaltender dropped into the butterfly. He's looking around that traffic, hoping he can find it. Sault Ste. Marie's goal-scoring abilities have been on full display so far this evening and here in the third. Really impressive display. They've moved the puck well, skated, really forecheck well there's really nothing they haven't done tonight and that one's stolen at center ice nice pass back moves the puck inside the offensive zone makes the save with possession along the wall puts the puck on net and makes the save sears taking it from his own end here they come on the attack takes the feed with the stop Quick feed to Roberts. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Effective use of the paddle on that one. The Huck moves it around along the half wall. And a smart heads up read to come up with the puck. Moves the puck along the half wall. on the ice here. Now the puck sails down to the far end of the ice. So go back to the defensive zone and try it again. Sault Ste. Marie's laying up pounding on the opposition tonight, generating numerous scoring chances and converting on what feels like almost all of them. That goes off a twig. Slides it over with pace to Pekka. Dumps it in. Ruin Noranda's got the puck along the boards. Grabs the puck in the defensive zone. 
They've got numbers. It's a two-on-one. Snaps one here in the slot. Oh, wide of the net. No, he's got to get that on target. That's a scoring chance, and he doesn't even make a, the goaltender make a save. A howitzer. He scores. They might as well keep that light on behind the goaltender. Man, again? That's four straight for them here. They have just totally taken over this game. Face off here in the neutral zone, and we are back underway. The Greyhounds gain control of the puck against the wall. The Huskies take possession of the neutral zone. Back to the point it goes. Nice pass. Here's an opportunity, and that one's turned away. Receives the pass. On the attack along the boards. Centered out in front. Can't connect. Moves it quickly over to Roberts. Big time defensive play. Trying to get back on the attack now. Along the half wall with the puck. Coming on. Fire. Sometimes it's just your night. You shoot the puck, it goes in the net. He's had an unbelievable evening. Sault Ste. Marie's offense has not been a problem tonight. They put a lot of shots on net and lead it big time late in this third period. Here's a chance! And rings the iron! Oh. Takes the feed. Into the offensive end now. 